Another quick review now, this time of Mebo, the instant messaging application. All we have to do is click on Add, and we can add any type of different messaging client. We've got AOL, Facebook, ICQ, MSN, MySpace. I'm just going to add an MSN one this time. Uh, this is just a test email address. It's not my real email address. So if you just simple setup, just to add the details in there, and then click Sign On. And then we have the buddy list. Obviously, there's only one on there at the moment because this is a test account. It's going to open up a conversation with uh, that contact. And then just uh, give you a feel for what the chat windows look like. When we get an incoming message, you should be able to see at the top in the notification window. It comes up and tells me what the message is and who sent me it. So if I'm not if I'm in a different application, it will come up and I'll know what's going on. It also gives you the ringtone and vibration, so you know what's going on. I've pressed the menu button. I can remove the contact, go back to the buddy list, or close that conversation. So if I go back to the buddy list, I can also long press on the conversation and just click close conversation to get rid of it as well. Uh, now I've got a menu button again. I just go to settings. And we've got the different options there, sign on automatically, and then the blink and vibrate options. On Mebo, only different buddy lists are in one section, so you'll have your Facebook and MSN all in the same list, but you can close up the different lists as well. And if I go back to the account page there, it's just as simple as doing a long press, and then click and remove to get rid of an account.